Hey guys, this is Hero. Welcome to another daily MLB 9 Innings 18 video. Uh, today I am recording it a little bit differently. I'm not 100% uh, sure how this is going to turn out. The, the device I normally record on wasn't updating correctly, so I am attempting to do it via the YouTube gaming app, so I don't know how it'll turn out. Heck, I don't even know if this mic is recording in the app. I assume it is, but you never know. Um, so last night, live update, they added uh, new Prime players. Sadly, none of them will help me, but... It's always nice when they add new players. They added, what, uh, three Marlins, Royals, Indian, Yankee, a ton of them. Twelve, I think, was the total. So if any of you happen to get one of the new primes, uh, leave a comment and of what you get. I think Luis Gonzalez was one of the better ones to get. Heck, if I got him, I'd be tempted to replace my Beltran with him. I don't know if that was the year he hit a, a lot of... Oh, I could use fires. Uh, a lot of home runs, or the most he had. So it looks like it's going to be in longer yet until they release the clubs. I was really hoping that it would be with this last update. But at least they gave us something worthwhile. At least for most people. I mean, they added a hey, Verlander. Would that be number four or five? Um... What Chanho Park they added. One thing I've noticed is players 2000 and later are prime, and 1999 earlier are like, uh, yeah, vintage slash legend. So I don't know if they'll ever add up anyone before 99 and call them a prime or not. Personally, the Primes, there are things that are a lot better about the Primes. The fact that you know exactly what the grade increase is going to be. That is one of the best things about them. Also, uh, they're more common. So, that you're likely to get one. compared to a vintage player. But, if you spend money, they have vintage packs that you can buy. And supposedly, they will be adding vintage basic packs, but who knows how you'll be able to earn those. Let's move on to silver packs after these. Yeah, tomorrow, definitely we'll be recording on a different device, assuming like, the update actually works. I'll have to update it at work. Oh, God. Yeah, 
part of the reason I waited to do my packs was in case they added something, which they did. All right, let's do these silver packs. Nothing there. Yeah, I don't care about the live pack so much. I'll go out of order this time and do my team selects now. I wonder if he got a, a good buff. Because he's been pitching well all year. Yeah, 75 as a silver for a reliever. That's good. He's got to be around, what, 70 base? At the end of the season, if he's still that high, I, he'd be one to great increase because he's got to be one of the best Tiger relievers. Boom. It's an arch band. Premium packs don't let me down. You let me down. I wonder if they have any plans of adding any Tiger Primes in the future. <sighs> I feel like the Tigers are one of the teams that have the fewest in the game. Considering they only have four, two, uh, blah, one with JV. Come on, Vintage. I just want a vintage. I don't even care who it is at this point. No vintage, no prime. Maybe my shuffles will get something good. Jorge Posada, Diamond Prime, come on. He stayed. Uh, well, that is surprising. Two v sixteen. That'd be a good one to get. Garis. Oh, come on. 
You should at least put one diamond in the shuffle if you use. Ontario. Here, I'll open up some intermediates. Come on, Kluber. Well, that is going to be it for today. Got a few diamonds. Amazingly, I had a chance at a new diamond prime. Uh, wouldn't, didn't expect to see them for ages. Uh, so. Yeah, if you enjoyed today's video, please feel free to like, favorite, and subscribe for more daily videos, and I'll talk to you guys later.